let's chat a bit. Um, I am currently working as an environmental consultant, and yeah, I feel like I don't know. My head is just everywhere all the time, and I don't know. I've been feeling quite overwhelmed. And in my previous video, I spoke about anxieties, and I have been going through a lot of anxiety. I have no idea why. Um, a lot of things have been tapping into my insecurities, and like yeah, I'm just not the best self that I could be but I'm trying to get myself one day at a time because I feel like um, of late like I've been in the mindset of literally not lifting myself up I have been pulling myself down like pointing out what the bad things are like I've been, been in just a negative space and it's okay it happens to the most of us like it happens to the most of us and once in a while we fall back but the most important part of life is being able to pick yourself back up like a lot of things have been playing into account for example my weight gain uh people are pointing it out so much like i already know i have gained weight nobody needs to tell me <laughs> I already know, you know what I mean? So you don't need to tell me. Like, I know my body, I know myself, I know that I was so active and I have, like, not been active. But, like, when people point it out sometimes, it becomes, it becomes overwhelming. Like, you don't know what I'm going through, so don't point out, oh, you've added a bit of weight, you don't look at anymore. Shut up okay just be quiet you don't know what i'm going through just let me live through all the phases of my life and i feel like i still look okay i still look good but it, like sometimes when people point out the negative things that are happening or not negative really but like tap into your insecurities and then they talk about it it makes you feel quite overwhelmed and i'm like yo i know this happened you don't need to tell me um um sorry i don't know i think i'm next to a train station um you don't need to tell me that i've gained weight i already know it i'm in my body you know what i mean and let me live out through whatever i'm living out let me feel whatever i'm feeling there's no need to point into other people's business you know what i mean but yeah that's what i've been feeling guys and yeah today i carried some green juice that i got from woolies um but i haven't had breakfast yet i feel like having a wrap and a coffee i haven't had my morning coffee i'm trying these days to have coffee at like 11 it's currently 9 30 but i think today i'm gonna have an early one because sometimes because i drive a lot i feel so sleepy i feel so sleepy so i feel like i just want to have my morning coffee and have breakfast so that um so that i can start off my day but my day starts so early at six o'clock that's why sometimes it's hard for me to vlog but we're doing it and i feel like i'm enjoying it at least i have you guys to keep me company so yeah i'm currently waiting for the guys to finish a job here then i'll go to my next job site pick up some samples um yeah watch some tiktoks as i wait yeah, I'll see you guys. A bit of chit chat. That was me ranting. But yeah, man, like, don't be going and tapping on people's insecurities. You're gonna make them feel worse. Try and look for a way to encourage them instead of.
driving this car still getting used to it still getting used to it letting you guys know I got a coffee from this fireplace called Firestone hands down I think it's one of the best coffees and then I also got a wrap I haven't eaten from morning till now so I'm trying to eat as I work I'm trying to eat as I work guys I'm trying to do th 10 things <laughs> I'm trying to do 10 things at the same time so I'll catch you guys when I'm in my next site and when I'm a bit calm okay bye Hey guys, so um, I'm at home now. Hey guys, I you guys straight, sorry. Hey guys, so this is my vlog, my day three. I'm at home now. Guys, to be honest, I'm supposed to go to the gym, but I didn't end up going to the gym. And I'm not gonna beat myself up about it because I have something that I'm dealing with. I've been waiting for a phone call that I, for a meeting, I've been waiting. And I would have gone to the gym, but the person hasn't called me, so I'm just waiting. So I feel, yeah, I feel a sense of disappointment in myself that I haven't gone to the gym, but it's not in my control, you know what I mean? Like, I want to go in the evening, but I can't because I don't want to make excuses. I don't want to make excuses. Today has been a good day. Um, I would say 75% good the rest has just been there it's just because as i was talking to you guys earlier like there's a lot of the sense of feeling very overwhelmed and i'm feeling a lot of anxiety especially as we come to the end of the year there's so much to think about there's so much reflection going on there's so much beating yourself up and which i shouldn't because you want to have done this you want to have done this but i don't know what can i do to make myself better and that's a question I've been asking myself so many times through the year, this year especially. Um, 2023 for me hasn't been an easy year, um, but I am still joyous that I have breath in my lungs and they didn't start without me, you know what I mean? So I am happy about that. But other than that, guys, we are holding on to dear life by this train, right? And. I am just trying, I called my therapist, I talked to her, she made me feel better and I'm just gonna sleep today and wake up tomorrow and we'll see how we feel tomorrow. But thank you so much guys for keeping me company. I am going to end the vlog here, I'm not gonna do much after, I just want to wait for this call and see if this person will call me, edit this vlog, um, eat and then go to sleep. I'll see you guys tomorrow.